Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Oh, haven't pressed my button team. That's no good, is it? Oh. <laughs> good morning, team. I thought you would like to see me pressing some buttons. I thought that would be a lovely message for you today. <laughs> Not so much, huh? Not so much. How are you? Are you having a better day than I am? <laughs> I'm actually having a really good day. I just can't work my buttons out. There we go. I'm in. I'm in. <laughs> good morning, team. Good morning. Welcome to my virtual uh, studio or digital studio live, whatever you want to call it. Welcome. So today, um, I'm doing 15 minutes of uh, Pilates on your lower legs. Put your hands on your ribcage. Big deep breath in, in through the nose and out through the mouth. Go again. Big deep breath in through the nose and out through your mouth. So this is called lateral breathing. The reason you've got your hands on your rib cage is so that you can feel the ribs going out to the side and back down and underneath. Go again, big deep breath in, big deep breath out. Go again, big deep breath in, big deep breath out. So carry on that big deep breathing in through the nose if you can and then out through the mouth if you can. Go again, big deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth and relax your arms and just circle through the shoulders. So this is how every single class of mine starts, all of my Pilates class. We always do the same, uh, same few exercises to get lovely and warm. So then we add in the elbows, then we make it a little bit bigger, full arm swing, and then we bring it right back and down. Then we bend the knees and we just rock the pelvis forwards and back forwards and back. So I'm going somewhere with this. I want you to make a mental note how far forward, how far back. Stop in the middle. Then I want you to grow through the top of your head. Yeah, so we've got our hips bang in the middle now. This is your neutral spine. I want you to give me a big deep breath in. Breathe out and squeeze all the muscles as if you're stopping a wee Stop in a trunk. Anything that you can control downstairs, squeeze it. Big deep breath in. Breathe out and let it go. Team, we're activating your pelvic floor. Big deep breath in. Breathe out. Let's squeeze again. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. From the ground floor all the way up, tight as you can. Imagine a lift. Yep, you've gone from the ground floor with those muscles downstairs. Tight as you can. There's your 10th floor. Big deep breath in. Breathe out and let it go halfway, fifth floor. Hold it there. Hold it, hold it. Give me another big deep breath in. Breathe out, can you let it come down a tiny bit more? So those wee muscles, the trump muscles, they're just under half clenched. Hold it there, body like a wooden plank. Come forward, then bring it back and come back, 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 back. Go again, forward, 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 like a wooden plank and then come back. So you're challenging yourself to see how far you can go without falling over. You got it? Bring it back for me, up nice and tall. Now, just walk through those legs, walk through those legs. Just walk through it. Yeah, I need to make sure those feet are nice and warm. We're gonna use those in a sec. First of all, Draw me a nice big semicircle, flat foot as you come through. So nothing else is moving. If you were doing this behind your peninsula in the kitchen, or behind a little wall, or behind a bar, if only, team, I would think, look at that person standing dead still. Hold it here in front. Team, what we're actually doing is just warming up this hip in uh, the leg in the hip socket. Just keep it coming, still pulling up through the top of your head. Bring it back, give me the other one. Draw me a semicircle flat foot as you come through. Dead easy. So the abs are braced now, team. So that means pull your tummy in. Pelvic floor still at number four. Have you forgotten? If you have, take it back up to number 10. Hold it at the front. Bring your pelvic floor down to number five and then just under at number four. Just keep it coming. Team, bring it back. Give it a shake. Alrighty, let's get a few exercises packed in. First one, opening the gate. Stand nice and tall. Abs in, pelvic floor at four. 
pick up one leg. I need your knee level with your hip. Then open it out, bring it back, put it down. Go again. Lift it up, open it out, bring it back, put it down. You got it? Lift up, open, bring it back, put it down. So again, nothing else is moving just yet until we bring in the arms. You ready? Your arms up, open, bring them back, put them down, go again. Abs are in. Now, every time you open these arms, I want you to squeeze behind your shoulders. Squeeze there. Bring it back. Put it down. Go again. Up and open. Bring it back. Put it down. Go again. We're up. We're open. So here we're firing up all the little muscles in your hips. Just keep it coming. The abs are braced. We're up. We're open. Come back. Put it down. Go again, up and open. Here comes a repeater. That means you stay on the leg. We're gonna load it up, stay on this leg. Don't put it down. Now don't let the thigh sink. Keep it up, keep your body lifted. Chest is proud, squeezing behind those shoulders. You got it? Just keep coming, put it down. Other side, come with me. Up and open, repeat to this leg, go again, in and out, so don't let the thigh sink, keep it up, squeeze behind those shoulders, nearly there, one more, one more, bring it back for me, put it down, give it a shake, give it a shake, we're going again, we're going to lift up and hold, Abs braced, pelvic floor at four. Come on then. Lift it up. Open it out. Hold it here. Now, can you extend the leg and bring it back? What do you reckon? Out and in. Out and in. Now, lift up here. Lift up. That's it. Someone's pulling your hair, making you stand super tall. Nearly there. Nearly there. It should be getting heavy here in the thigh. You got it? Close it, put it down. Give me the other side. Abs in, pelvic floor at four. Extend and bend. Extend and bend. Go again for me. Come on, out and in. Out and in. Brilliant, one more. Close it, put it down. Okay. So that was your hips. Let's have a look now at your quads and your booty. <laughs> Let's have a look at your glutes. Team up nice and tall. I want you to tip at the hip and I want you to bend your knees. You might want to take your legs a teeny bit wider. Hips width or slightly wider. Come on then. So sink down, bottom goes back. Press through the feet and up you come. Go again, sink back and up you come. Go again, sink back, abs in, abs in, up you come, again, sink back, go again, we go, down, open the arms, bring it back, press through the feet, go again, come down, open, bring it back, press through those feet, down, have you still got your abs in, again, down, open, bring back, come with me team, watch my feet, watch my feet, heels come up, hold it, put it down, bring back, press through the feet, rebuild the spine, go again, sink back, open, feet, heels up, hold it, put it down, bring back, we're moving on, come with me, down, open, Heels off, stand up, wait. Oh, can you balance? Put it down, come again. So, your chest only comes forward naturally. So you're not leaning forward and put it down. Show me again. So, butt back, chest forward rather than down. Heels off, stand up, 
Have you got those abs in? Yeah, hold it. Go again. Sink back. Squeeze behind shoulders. Abs in, heels up. Hold it. Pelvic floor at four. Team, how about the other direction? Come with me. Side. Sink it back. I've got my heels off. Come on, come down, come down, come down. Put it down. Uncurl again, sideways. Take your heels off the floor. Hold it. So team, if you didn't want your heels off the floor, just do it with me here, yeah? Sink back. Hold it here. And up we come. Team, I've got a great idea. How do you fancy a repeater? You'd love one, huh? Hold it here. Does it look like you're sitting on a chair? These arms open and close. Stay down. No floating up. Squeeze behind the shoulders. Oh, it's feeling wobbly. Four. Three more if you can. Rest if you need to. Two more. It's all shaky. One more. Put it down. Oh, team. That's what happens when you do that. After a spin class and after a hip class. <laughs> doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Team, heels together. Raise, bring it down. Go again. So up and down. Remember that, we're coming back. Hands in front, big deep breath in. Breathe out, take your arms to the side of the room. Big deep breath in, breathe out and bring it back. Shoulders back, grow tall. Breathe out, go round to the other side. So your eyes go with you and bring it back. So what am I looking for here? Big deep breath in, abs are in. I want you to go round as far as you can until you feel a lovely stretch in the back. So it will be more inclined on one side than the other. And then when you go on the other side, we're looking to pinpoint a stretch slightly more on one side of your back than the other. Bring it back. You got it? Go again. Abs in. So if you've got your abs in, firing up the obliques around your waist, bring it back. You got it? Now here. <laughs> Other side. Round you go. Bring it back. Heels off. Stand tall. Go again. Pull the shoulders back. Lift the chest. Round we go. Round. Bring it back. Heels come off. Watch. Up. Bend. Up. Round to the other side. A nice spine twist there. Team. Bend. And up. Uh-oh. Let's go again. So around. Bring it back. Heels off first. Up. Then a bend. Go again. Other side. Bring it round. Come on, use your eyes, use your nose, but keep your hips forward. Bring it back, bend first, and up. Stay here, team. Bend, and up. Bend, and up. This reminds me of grade one ballet. <laughs> oh, it was like it was yesterday. Go again. Bend, and up. Bend and up. Team, stay up. Bend your legs. Uh-oh. Hands are on for balance. Up you come. Oh. Again for me. Take it down. Knees over toes. Oh, not too far down, team. Can we do two more? Come on, come down. Down you come, down you come, down you come. Ugh. Press through the balls of your feet. Remember, if your feet are not liking that, you can be here. And just give me one here. Then press through the feet. One more. Down we go. Down, 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 down. Up we come, team. Up. Give it a shake. Give it a shake. Well done, team. How are your legs? How are your legs? Just walk through those feet. Yeah, you might want to do that. Yeah, good toes and naughty toes. And that. And take it round. 
give him a shake. How do you feel? Yeah, do you feel a bit more energized? Do you feel a bit more relaxed? How do you feel? Different people respond differently to different Pilates moves. That's what it's all about. Okay, if you would like to do some more, then come and see me in class or you can watch a recording. There's a load of recordings on Vimeo. Um, just put my name in, Helen McClory. Um, or I'm popping this up onto YouTube as well. Go and have a look at my YouTube channel. Um, all week I'm putting 15 minute free tasters up there. So go and have a look. Again, it's YouTube uh, slash Helen McClory. It's just my name. M -C -C -L -O -R -R -Y. M-C-L-O-R-R-Y. That's all it is. Okay? Um, otherwise, have an amazing day. And um, tomorrow we'll do another free 15 minute session. Or hopefully I'll see you in Pilates tonight. Um, if you want to come tonight, go onto the website, helenmcclory.com, go to the live timetable, go to Tuesday 8.15pm, click on it and ask to join the class and come and see a full class in action. Um, uh, yeah, make sure you do it before tonight, so do it now, book on now, um, that way I can get you sorted out. If I've already started work, it's really difficult for me to do the admin. Anyway, I'm off. I'm going to go and have some breakfast. Have an amazing day. It looks like a scorcher out there. So have an amazing one, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, bye, bye.